This tutorial is about ThingLink, an app which turns a page interactive. Okay, so first open the app and then click Get Started. Then all you need to do, um, it's free, uh, is type in your email address and then after click I do not have a code, say that you're a teacher and then you don't need to set a password if you don't want to and then just sign up. You can click for weekly updates if you want. So here's some examples that have been made for you. So we'll just choose the shipwreck. Okay, so this is the thing link um, and it's got a quick demonstration for you of what it's about. So let's just go back. So it's just create your own. Press the plus in the top right corner. Now you can start with your own picture or you can take a photo which is what I asked my students to do today. So we were doing series and parallel circuits. So I asked them to take a picture of the circuits they had drawn and then basically bring it to life. So all you need to do once you've done this is just tap where you want and you can choose whether to add text or media. So here I've added some text. So let's choose somewhere else now and we'll add some more text. So I asked the students to define what a parallel circuit was and what a series circuit was. Let's add some media now. Again, really easy to do. Just click where you want, then go to add media. And then you can take a video, a photo, choose a photo from the gallery, or you can go straight from YouTube. So I'm going to go on to straight from YouTube. Just type in what you want, so my keyword's going to be circuits, and then just choose an appropriate video. So there's perfect series and parallel circuits. And then it's asking, it says you can add some more. So I'm going to, this time, um, I'm actually asked my students um, to take a selfie video. So just click the camera the other way, and then where what you've pointed to you can just start talking about so I can start talking about a series circuit or a parallel circuit um, which is what I did and then there's your video automatically replaced placed in the um, thing link okay so that's enough um, for the explanation for now so to finish off just hit next in the top right and then you can um, preview or save your thing link. So I'm going to hit save. And then finally, um, this is an example of me actually using it. So you can really see it brings the page to life. Great for revision. And there's the YouTube clip playing. And it almost looks like it's coming out of the page. Thank you for watching.